Dan Feeney was good from the word go. Dan Feeney is a guy who opened up a lot of holes for a lot of good running backs. The thing I remember about Feeney is it was his freshman year and we're there at camp and kind of got that 10 minutes or so off to the side with Kevin Wilson while things were getting going. And I was asking him about freshmen and he said, we have a freshman offensive lineman who I think is going to start from day one. And he's not going to start because we're weak at his position. He's going to start because he is ready to go. I mean, he started all 12 games as a freshman, didn't allow a single sack the entire year. And then that next year, he started all 12 games again on a team that set a program record for rushing yards. One of four Indiana players to be named first team All-American twice, a four-year starter, blocked for a 2,000-yard rusher in Tevin Coleman, blocked for a couple thousand-yard backs in 2015, and Jordan Howard and Devine Redding. Great blocking to the right side of that offensive line. Dan Feeney, we talked about him earlier. Indiana had a very underrated offensive line. The reason they're underrated, they blocked uh, one season for Tevin Coleman, who gained over 2,000 yards. And you can't gain over 2,000 yards as a running back unless you have an awful good offensive line. They were a good offensive line, but Feeney, in, the, in my mind, was the guy that stood out in that group. Here's what made Dan Feeney so good. They used to pull a lot of linemen and demand that their linemen also get up to the second level. And the reason that Tevin Coleman exploded for over 2,000 yards, the reason that Jordan Howard had such a great year when he was there was because of not only the scheme of Kevin Wilson, but guys like Dan Feeney. Dan Feeney was an old school enforcer. What does that mean? It means a guy that's gonna lead with his hat and his hands, and he will take you to the ground by any means necessary. He was also, of course, a really good in pass protection, but just overall with Dan Feeney, I think the thing that stood out to me is he was ready to go from day one. He worked really hard. That was the other thing that stood out. You saw him in practice. He never, ever took a playoff, and that translated to the games. Dan Feeney, someone who really resonated with me from this past decade.